Hi to all, welcome to Rams Android Tutorials. In this video tutorial, we are going to discuss how to display websites inside our application. We have a concept of implicit intent. Using implicit intent, uh, we can navigate to the browser application. Means from our application, we can go to the browser application and we can open any website now. But it's an external case. Now we want to open any website inside our application means inside an activity. So let us see how we can do that one. So I have created the project called web view. So in that uh, we have a main activity defaultly we are getting. In that XML file I am taking web view. So that uh, changing the layout first of all to a linear layout. linear layout and uh, we are taking the orientation vertical and uh, this one I am changing to button and these properties are not required just I am deleting them and text so whenever I click the button I am going to load my blog so my blog name is rams android for all dot blogspot.in and uh, width I am making as a match parent now below of this button I want to load a web view so let me give the id the ray plus id button underscore block now below of this button I am going to take the web view so we have a tag called web view tag using that only we are going to load the website and uh, id I am taking as a Ray plus ID web view. Now I am coming to the Java class. Means an activity. In this activity, I am going to call the web view first of all. Web view. Web view. And the view we are going to call web view equal to uh, typecasting web view. And we are calling the method find a view by id or dot id dot web view now we are calling the button button underscore blog equal to typecasting button and a find a view by id method or dot id dot button underscore blog now button underscore blog dot set on click listener of new on click listener new on click listener in that we have an on click method so whenever i click this button then we want to load the website so my website is rams android for all dot blogspot dot com um, okay i think i have some internet issue Android. Fine, this is my blog Rams Android for all dot blogspot.in. Now, simple in the web view class, we have a method load URL method. In that, uh, we need to paste the URL, means which website you want to load, that one we need to paste. And uh, before that, we need to call the method in the web view class set web view client, and in that, we need to create an object for the web view client. Fine. Now after that in the manifest file we need to give the permission that is an internet permission. Go to the manifest file and here we are going to provide the permission. Uses permission that is a internet permission. Fine. This is the program. Now let us execute this program.
now let me check there are some errors what kind of errors we are having orientation this is not we are using tools also we are not using everything is fine java code no errors and let me clean the project once fine uh, got the problem here it's a vertical i missed r letter fine now let me run the application So here we got an output. So I'm going to click this button. Now downside in the web view, it should load the block. It's taking the time. Now you'll see block loaded. Now inside our activity only, we are able to load any website. Now if you click this any uh, particular item also, it is going to load that item here. Okay, so this is the web view concept. So using this concept, you can load websites thank you for watching if you like my videos you can subscribe my channel and uh, you can share my video thanks for watching we will meet in the next video tutorial